So another quick tip, this time taking a basic oscillator, a basic voice, turning it into a monster, something that has a bit more weight to it. This we will do with a unison module from Bog Audio that will basically take a monophonic pitch and gate and will multiply it, will duplicate it, will create copies of this voice and with the ability to detune the pitch. And this will create this unison effect that will create something that has a bit more weight to it, something a bit larger than the original sound. So basically here I have a simple subtractive voice. I have an oscillator, a sawtooth going through a filter and the VCA and I have an envelope controlling the VCA and the filter, a really basic subtractive voice. It will sound like this. Right, it already sounds nice, but now we can create this unison effect. So if I bring it, uh, this module here in between, I'm using a, a MIDI in this case, but you can also use a sequencer or your DAW even. Right, so the pitch will go first to the unison module also the gate and now the unison will basically multiply will duplicate uh, those signals into a polyphonic signal so i'm going to take the pitch back to the oscillator and the gate back to the envelope right now nothing will happen because we have to choose how many channels we want how many copies of this voice we want if i go with two for example right you can see already everything here became polyphonic the cables became thicker um, which means that now you have to make sure you have a polyphonic chain, but let's have a listen to this. With some detune. Right, without. And with. We can go even further with this having, let's say, five voices. Right, now there are a few things you can do here in this case because it's polyphonic. If you don't want to uh, keep a polyphonic chain, because again, now we will have five oscillators, five filters, five VCAs and five ADSRs. This might uh, consume a lot of CPU and also maybe you're using different modules that are not polyphonic. You can use the sum module from VCV directly after the oscillator, this will sum, in this case, the five channels, again, up to 16, into a monophonic signal you can then use. So from here, you see it says mono. From here, it will turn uh, monophonic, but... We still get this effect. Let's go totally crazy here with 16 voices, much more detune. Ooh! Right, what I like to do is actually spread the polyphonic voices through the stereo field, and I'm going to use the spreader from Mokba for this. So I'm going to get rid of this uh, sum module. Right, and then the oscillator will go to the filter, and instead directly to the mixer, it will go to the spreader. Here we can change the spread and the volume. Maybe we'll take the volume a bit down. Right, so now it's also spread in the stereo field. So we have now 16 copies of these uh, voices that are a bit detuned. And this creates this really nice unison effect.